as a child left inside a vehicle that at one point was 124 degrees inside. That girl was rushed to the hospital in critical condition. Tonight, the police department that came to the rescue. This is glass from the SUV window Fisher's police busted to pull a 16-month-old girl out of what felt more like an oven. In fact, Fisher's police say it was 124 degrees inside the vehicle after they pulled the girl to safety. This is a very, very dangerous situation, and we need to be more careful about where our children are and use common sense. Officers were called to this parking lot on the 7800 block of 86th Street at about 3.15 in the afternoon. The child's mother, 30-year-old Meg Trueblood, was apparently shopping while police were in rescue mode. Authorities say the girl began having seizures shortly after being taken inside an air-conditioned building. Well, I'd say she, that child's lucky to be alive. I mean, that's, that's terrible. Her mother was arrested. She was shopping, uh, and it had been shopping for upwards of an hour inside the store. Uh, she uh, did not uh, recognize uh, the danger that she had placed her child in. We did reach out to the State Department of Child Services. A spokesperson could not comment on the specifics of this case, but the agency says there are consequences for these types of situations. DCS is you know, required by law to step in and, and they can remove the child from the home because DCS's primary responsibility is to protect you know, children. Children, particularly infants, children and the elderly in conditions like this um, are the most vulnerable. The toddler in this case was taken to Peyton Manning Children's Hospital. Her mother, Megan Trueblood, is facing a criminal charge of neglect of a dependent. That is a B felony. If convicted, it carries a jail term of 6 to 20 years in prison and a fine up to $10,000.